Hey guys, this is a video tutorial on how to make a movie poster with Canva. So first, you're going to type in canva.com in your tab and click enter so it takes you to the site. It should pull up something like this, but before you can start making anything, you need to log in. So click the login button. And it gives you all these options, but you're going to continue with email. And then you're going to type in your Cherokee school email. So that's mine. And when you type it in, it should pop up single sign-on enabled. When you do that, click continue, and it will log you into your personal account. So we are using Canva to make movie posters. So what you're going to do is type in movie poster in that search bar, click enter, and it will take you to all of these pre-made movie poster templates, which are all super cool, super fun. It has fonts already created, it has, you know, things set up for the tagline, for the actors in it, for the title, when it's going to premiere. Um, you're welcome to use any of these pre-made templates as long as you edit it to make sure that it matches what your movie is going to be about. Um, if your movie doesn't have whatever this character is, I probably wouldn't use this poster. But if you like the fonts and the way it's set up, you can use this and just delete the background picture and upload your own. Um, if you don't like anything that they have here and you want to start from scratch, you can also use this to create a blank movie poster. Um, However, I'm going to show you how to um, edit a pre-made template because you'll be able to do the same stuff if you're creating a blank movie poster. So I like this one right here. It's going to pop up with your template. I'm personally going to zoom in a little bit so I can see everything a little better. So you notice it has places for you to put your actors or for you guys it's your characters a film by, that's where your name would go. It has the title, the premiere date, and here it says visit our website. You guys are required to have a tagline for your movie, so I would actually use one of these to put your tagline. Um, you can check out the rubric for more de details and information on that, but um, to edit it, all you have to do is click on it. And I'm just going to say the title is Snyder's movie. Um, and this is a film by Miss Snyder. Um, if I liked the fonts, and, but this image in the background does not match what my movie is about, all you have to do is select it. You can see the blue outline of it, and you'll see like all these little options pop up. Just click delete and it'll go away. If you hover over the, t the template, you can see your text is still there, but it's not visible because it's white right now. So for you to be able to see it, you need to change the color, at least until you decide on a background image. So you can use several things to create this poster. Um, once you can see all your writing again, I'm just going to change a couple of them so that you can see them again. So this is plain, this is boring. You can use the elements and the upload and the text to add more to your movie poster to make it what fits your movie the best. So if I didn't like this font after a while and I wanted to change it to something else, I can scroll through here and look at all of these really cool font options. Um, if I wanted to upload my own image, let's just say mine was over, um, if this is a movie about me, I'm going to upload a picture about me and my husband and my dog. You can download pictures and upload them as your background. And once it's uploaded, you can drag and drop and crop it to the size that you want it. And there it is. It's in your movie now. Um, you can also click on elements and add different graphics. They have photos, pre-made photos, videos, um, 
lines, shapes, animals. Uh, it has suggestions up here that you can just scroll through and click if you want. However, um, you can also type things in. So if I wanted to add a heart, I'm going to type in heart and I have all of these cool options that I can add. Um, I like this big white one because you'd be able to see it better. Oh, and look, it changed to black. So I'm going to change the color of it to white. I'm going to rotate it so it's like at an angle. And you can just play around with it. Um, whenever you are ready to share, let's say I'm done. I checked over the rubric, um, which is on Canvas under this assignment. I've got everything that I need. Um, and I'm ready to submit. What I'm going to do is click the share button. Where it says link sharing restricted, I'm going to change that to anyone with the link. And then I'm going to change can edit to can view. And then I'm going to click copy link. When I copy the link, um, it is on my clipboard. I'm going to go straight back to that unit 4 task 3 movie poster assignment. Click Start Assignment, and it has a blank for you to paste the URL. So you're going to paste your URL, and then you will submit the assignment. Um, if you have any other questions or need help, I'm always available to help you out.